What's going on everybody? It's your boy the Mr. Fox back in the house from my hiatus from the holidays. I know I've been gone for a while, but I'm back. Sorry for the wait. Um, so I'm going to get these reactions out as quick as possible. So this one right here is going to be a twofer. This is going to be my unordinary reaction to episode 121 and 122, you know, or whatever flows your boat, whatever gets you by. Um, so yeah, I heard some of these chapters were kind of kind of short, so I'm going to put them together and all that. But be sure they're on, they're coming soon. Um, and if I have the same shirt on, that's because most of these are going to be recorded all in one day. So, but that's enough talking. Let's get into this chapter. Last time I left off, can Serafina be confronted by them punks that she beat up by that punk she beat up, and he has some friends with him back at school. We see John. And John is thinking, I thought she'd be here by now. Alrighty. Okay, he texts her. And she doesn't text back. Hmm, where is she? Ring, 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 ring. We're sorry. The number you have reached is not available right now. Please leave a message after the beep. Beep. That's weird. Getting straight into it. All right. It's walking. I love how every time uh, when or Sensei uh, shows people walking, she always put like tap, tap, tap. <laughs> but it just reminds me of people tap dancing. Oh, we see Blake. What's he up to? John. Damn, he always looks so mopey. I wonder why. Hmm. What's Blake want? Stay late today. I didn't know you did extracurriculars. He doesn't. I don't. I was waiting for someone. Oh, for who? Was it Serafina? None of your business. <laughs> Cold, man. Walks away. Bro, you really just gonna walk off like that? He's so difficult to talk to. I wonder why. For the most part, y'all y'all pretty much torture him. Hey, wait. You're heading back now? I j I'm just about to finish with my run, so uh, you want to work on homework together? Eep. That's weird. No, we're not weird, but I mean, maybe you haven't gotten the hint. I don't like you, so stop trying to talk to me. <laughs> well... At least we got that out in the open. He had to spell it out for him, but you know, whatever. We we know we know this now, and now we can move past it, hopefully. But since we're roommates, shouldn't we at least try to get to know each other? Yeah, maybe. I don't want to keep ignoring the person I'm living with. Who cares? We hardly know each other anyway. What? Nani? He grabs him. Hey, wait. Don't touch me. Last week, you were still glaring at me like I was trash. Now, all of a sudden, you want to be buddies? He has a point. No, thanks. I'm not falling for that BS again. <laughs> yeah, that's understandable. Concerning what Arlo did to him. Of course, I'm going to be pissed at you. You slapped my best friend when she was trying to help. You know, I actually forgot about that. You did. You did slap her. You can't be slapping women like that. <laughs> so you shot a beam at my face? <laughs> yeah, you can't deny that one. Look. As far as that situation goes, they were both in the wrong. John, I understand. Well, not understand. Like, I understand that John was in a bad mood at that time. But still, he, he shouldn't have slapped her in the face. But also... Uh, Blake didn't have to shoot a beam, even though Bla Blake's hot-headed like uh, like our boy John is. So hopefully we can turn them into. Hopefully they can be friends. I would. I wouldn't mind seeing that. If someone hit your best friend, 
would you let it slide point case in point right there because you know if it was Serafina you probably would have done the same thing or worse well actually worse we know your temperament <laughs> come on man I'm not looking to fight let's start over clean slate what do you say take him up on the offer man even <sighs> take him up on the offer I know what you've been through but I think I think what you think? I think these two could be really, t really close friends. They're both kind of stupid when it comes to class. Spare me the fake speech. I'm not interested. I mean, I kind of figured as much, but I mean, you can't really blame him, especially after all that crap that Arlo put him through when Serafina, when he got Serafina suspended and all that. <laughs> Walks away. Come on, man! Don't give up. What are you about to do? <laughs> F an a hole. The hell is your problem, dude? You gotta realize, that since he's been at this school, y'all have done nothing but berate him and beat on him at every well, at any and every opportunity. Maybe not you personally, but just everyone there in general. Even the low tiers don't even treat him with respect. We're back in the dorm. It's nighttime. Serafina. Still no word from Serafina? Huh. Where are you? Still no response. John, something is obviously up, dude. You know Serafina texts you back almost instantly. What the heck does that... I said... I said... So... What I'm assuming is Serafina is in the middle of a fight right now and she's butt texting him. Or something along those lines. Beep. Hey, sorry. About time. What happened? I didn't feel well after class, so I went home. And you didn't think of telling me at all? I've been waiting for you this whole time. Oops. My bad. Haha. -ha. I'll be sure to let you know next time. That text message seems suspicious to me hmm and he thinks so too something's obviously up because you don't go from texting nonsense to um, texting coherent sentences something's you feeling better now yeah for sure oops gotta go talk to you later okay now i know there's something wrong seraphina doesn't text like that like at all she always texts out the entire word the hell since when does she say oops type oops that's right something dude and you're going back to bed? Get off your tail! Not feeling well, huh? She seemed fine this morning. It's not an excuse, is it? In her thoughts. Well, at least she's okay now. My goodness. But something about the but something about the way she responded to my text seems really off. Go figure. What? Um. Not not again. Not again. Oh my goodness, Who, who's responsible? Well, I know who's responsible for this. Yeah, not, anything got it. They got a beat down, tied to a chair. Oh goodness, who is this? It's idiot boy right there. I don't know who these two are. These two are new. Your stupid cripple friend is so annoying. Hey, 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 wait a minute. We just got it. We just got new phone. You gonna break it? Hey, that was expensive. I'll make you pay for it. Please do. Oh, shut up. Oh, dang. Look, man. I know I've been saying for like, since I started doing these reactions and stuff, I don't know. If Serafina should get her powers back, because you know I don't know if it will really help her character out or not. But um, she needs her powers back. She, she no, this right here. I'm tired of seeing. Well, y'all can't see it. This right here. I'm tired of seeing this. This is this is has to stop. Look at her. She's coughing up blood now. And where is John? John is in the room. Not. In, oh my goodness. I'm getting irritated. Gosh, you're so dense. Haven't you realized it yet? You're not the same Serafina you once were. And... Whoa, what was this? Oh, happy holidays. Yep. 
I hope y'all had a happy holidays while I was gone and all that. I did. But that's enough talking. We're going we're jumping straight into the next to the next one. So this is 122. We're going to So it's nighttime still. Gosh, you're so dense. Okay, so we're picking up where pretty much where they left off at the end of the last chapter. Haven't you realized you're not the same fair you're not the same Serafina as you once were? Now you're just smacking down. You gotta slap her like that. Why you gotta be so rough? Get a load of her. Doesn't even have her ability anymore. She still thinks she like and she's still acting like she owns us. I don't know. Oh my goodness. I don't I ain't gonna understand that one because she kinda is, but still. I didn't know how two faced you people were. Sucking up to someone then attacking them the moment they're down. Yeah. Shame. For shame on you. You're supposed to be better. Who am I who am I kidding? These are high school students. High school students suck. Ha. You didn't actually think we liked you, right? You're your head is so far up in the clouds, you have no idea how it works down here. You're a high tier. Of course we'd kiss up to you. Dude, look at this. They have, oh my goodness. Where is John at? Because if we don't, you guys get offended. And we're punished for it. I mean, the other ones like Arlo and all them would, but I don't think Serafina didn't really care. Unless you were messing with John. Or it was a turf war, and then she had put you in your place. We're forced to bow down while you do nothing but scorn us. And we're sick of being treated like dirt. Understandably. See, this is the problem with the with the whole hierarchy thing. That's why it needs to be abolished. I mean, there's always gonna be people at the bottom who feel as if the you know the higher class looks down on them. And some you know what, that's another discussion. Let's keep going. So isn't this an interesting situation? You've suddenly lost your ability. And now you're powerless. Now, you, now you're the powerless one. It's quite the miracle. Almost, almost like it was meant to happen. Shut up. Look at, look at her. Look, what have they done to you? I mean, it's obvious, but still. So that you can finally get, the t get a taste of how the rest of us feel. Darn, you gonna kick her? Darn, she beat up enough. You ain't gotta kick her no more. Look at her, she grunting. No, that y'all, yeah, y'all look chumps fighting someone that's tied up in a chair. You ain't even fighting; you just kicking them. Hmm. Oh, this might be the thumbnail, or this one might be my thumbnail. Let's see. I don't know. I know who this guy is. That one? Nope. I don't know the rest of them. Jumping straight into it. On the ground, idiot mid-tears looking down on her. They're snickering. Ooh, a snicker. My anger is reaching to a point where I'm not acting like myself. I might need a Snickers bar. Darn, look at this, man. They got her tied up in everything. Humiliating. When I recover, I'll make you regret this. Oops, that is getting on my nerves. I don't, I don't really. That's for some reason, that 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 quirk of hers is getting on my nerves. Don't you mean if you recover? Oh, yep, she has a point. Give it up. You don't scare us anymore. We've all been watching you closely. Your ability has been gone, for, has gone missing for a while now, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. Even, even the. Even the peasants pay attention. So who's to say it's ever coming back? Darn! Oh, she grabbed it. I thought she punched her again. I'd prepare for the worst of it if I were you. You might, you might just be stuck like this forever. I hope not. I really want her to get her powers back. Only I'd really love for her powers to come back for this one moment in time, beat them, and then disappear, and then maybe come back later on permanently. It seems like this stress would induce her powers coming back. I can't do anything tied up like this. How do I break out of here? What would John do? Well, right now, I hope John would get up off his tail and go looking for you instead of sleeping in his bed. 
bunch of cowards beating me while I'm tied down. Why don't you face me head on? Oh, so you just can't. so just because you know a few tricks, you think you can fight your way out. I don't think her facial expression matches her words. But then again, it's just me. How arrogant. Hey, Elena? Is it Elena? I think it's Elena. Yeah, hey, Elena. Gotta admit, she has a point. Tying her up hardly does anything. Who are you? If we don't give her a chance to fight back, she'll never learn. Hmm. Take that stupid smirk off your face. Okay, then. Someone untie her. Let's see. All right, they're untying her. Girl, if I were you, I would have punched her smooth in the in the stomach right then and there. But she, but you know, she's tired. I can tell. Okay, she stands up. You should you should have been you should have been swinging the second that rope came off your hands. All right, Serafina. Young enough pushing me. You want to fight? Then we'll give you a fight. In fact, why don't we up the stakes a little? If you can take if you can take any one of us down in a one on one, we'll let you go. That is a lie. That is a lie. That is what John fell for, and he ain't falling for it again. Serafina, you shouldn't fall for it either. Sounds like a pretty good deal, huh? No, it sounds like a terrible. I mean, it does sound like a good deal, but only if you would keep up your end of the bargain. And why should I trust your word? Point. Again, with the entitlement. I'd just be grateful if I were you. Why? We're giving you an opportunity, after all. You say that as you start to kick her. Ooh. She ain't gonna be able to dodge this one. Okay, she blocked it. Alright, girl, come on! Show her what you made of. What? So strong! I'm assuming her ability is uh, just like physical enhancement. Kick. On the ground. Oh my goodness. On the ground again. And again with the smirk on the face. Is she about to pass out? I can't move my arm. Oh. Dang. Hold up. Wait a minute. Now let her catch your breath. Now you're tripping. Just gonna kick her while she's down. Mm -mm. Shame on you. Shame on you. Shame on you. Now, I know I know when, you know, Tuesday was taking out the trash with, you know, green hair Chung Lee or Junie, whatever you want to call her. I felt kind of bad. Uh, if he does the same thing to this person, Elena, I won't feel bad at all. I'm, I'll, I'll probably throw a party. I might have to call Tuesday in for another interview if that happens. I hope it does. Oops. Too bad. Looks like you lost this one. Serafina, zero. Lowly, useless, mid-tiers, one. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. You, even though they're rebelling against, you know, Serafina, even though she's, I mean, I guess, I guess you can call it rebelling. They still refer to themselves as lowly, useless, mid-tiers. Oh, goodness. I mean, if you want, if you're going, if you're going to try, you know, Puff yourself up. You would think you would come up with like a more, you know, better better name than that. You're still calling yourself lowly, useless mid-tiers. I'm pretty sure she means it as a joke, but still. I mean, come on now. That's just funny. That, that made me laugh. <laughs> so who wants, <laughs> who wants to go next? Who is this person walking up? Hey, Serafina. Remember me? I don't even remember. Do y'all remember her? Oh, she's the one Serafina face planted in the wall, like towards, like way towards the beginning of this of the series. You smashed my face into a wall. I like the callbacks here. She didn't. Or Chan hasn't just left, you know, forgotten about old characters. I still owe you for that. Wait, so the blonde girl was her friend next to her. So what are their names? Get up. <laughs> Look, man, you can tell there's no there's gonna be no joy in this, man. Look at her. Oh, my goodness, and she's she's beaten bad. Just one. 
All I have to do is beat one of them. Any one of them. And I can leave this place. Even if you did beat them. Even if you... I'm pretty sure if you start, start to get the upper hand, they would just jump you. They're not going to let this go. It, this has been going on for... Actually, what grade are, are they in? I'm assuming they're like 17, 18, so at least juniors, right? So it's probably going on for years, but still. Let me know in the comments. It'll pretty much work on any mid-tier who fights at close range. I'd expect most low ranks to just get scared and run away. As long as you can react faster than your opponent, you have a chance. In a normal situation where they're bo it is one on one, well, this is a one on one. But if Serafina was at tip top shape, then maybe. Well, hold on. I know it's tough, but try to stay strong, okay? Yeah, but it's not gonna work right now, girl. You're too you're too battered and bruised for this. Stay strong. And this person, and this is actually realistic. Why would you just wait and let someone try to talk themselves up or whatever? She looks like she had. It looks like a wind. Looks like a wind ability, or something. No, if, if it was wind, it would be probably considered a high tier. It's probably just like, I don't know. Ooh, she she hit her head. She gonna get you gonna get this girl a concussion. Yeah, she's she's fading out. Yeah, she's she's done. Look, oh my goodness. Don't I'm, don't worry, they gonna pay. Or it's uh, or a chance since they's gonna make sure they pay. Wow, out already. What'd you expect? You ain't like you found her off the street minding her business. You beat her up and then you tried to fight. Then you're gonna say out already? That wasn't even satisfying. Of course it wasn't. And who is this? Oh, that's that's the idiot she beat up earlier. Look at him. Going over there with a smug face. Not so tough anymore, are you? Better watch your step from now on. No. Oh, you. Not the one that sent the text messages and this one. I hope they get the worst beating that we have seen in the entire series. Like, forget the fight with uh, not even, forget the beat down with Zeke and uh Junie and forget the fight with Vulcan. I hope he gets his fate. Um, I'm almost hoping that they die, to be perfectly honest. So and, and a new example needs to be set. But that'll get cops involved. Pathetic. Face me head on. Face me head on, she says. Couldn't even get through two of us. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's call it for tonight. We'll meet back up here again tomorrow. Tie her up, will you? Hower. I'm reading this right. Hower. I, I want to say Howard, but there's no D. Whatever. Yeah. So she must be, she must out, outrank him for him to be like, yeah. Because he looks like, yes, master. Freaking lackey. We're really just going to leave her here. Eh, we'll figure it out. We'll figure out what to do tomorrow. What? Well, never mind. The, the faculty at the school don't really care. They just kind of keep to themselves. I'm surprised that they even have teachers. I'm surprised they just let them do what they want every day. Oh, my goodness. And... Okay, so nothing at the bottom. Um, These two chapters uh, have really, <laughs> really upset me. Um... Oh, Serafina caught again. John not picking up signals. I don't know what's going on. John's really dropping the ball here. He should have never left her by herself. Period. Point blank. Just don't do it. It's different with her. She was, she was once the queen who has now fallen from grace. And you don't think that the people at the bottom are not going to try and tear her limb from limb? Come on, man. Think about this. Think about what happened with you. Well, they rose up against you, but it's the same thing, pretty much. So, but these two chapters, they're good, and the fact that they got me, they got my blood boiling, I think I need a Snickers bar and all that, but, you know, stay tuned for my other reaction for this week's chapter, 
Um, actually, this week's chapter, as of the recording and all that, but like I said, I got I got more content reviews and reactions coming. So this one's a two for the next one is going to be by itself, and then I'm gonna get the uh, reviews done. But you know, sorry for being gone for so long. Thanks for watching this. This video is probably gonna be longer than most of my Noah videos, but we'll see. But you know, like, comment, subscribe, do all the stuff that I normally tell you to do. And with that being said, it's your boy Fox. Out.